Hey, welcome back to the channel. Today, um, I didn't get a lot done, but today I want to give you a sneak peek of what we've decided to do as far as uh, siding and the color of the outdoor kitchen. But first, I just want to congratulate Jeff at Bobblehead Homestead. Today he had his uh, cabin delivered, and that's been a long time uh, coming. And if you follow his channel, you know this is a pretty epic day. I don't like to use the word epic, but in this case, it was an epic day for Jeff and it was really awesome. He did a live stream and there were about a 11, or 1,126 people, 1,126 watching the live stream. So that was really cool to see all of that support for him. And uh, Prepsteader Bob from the Self-Reliant Roadshow and Mrs. B were there and Bob was helping the trailer company get the trailer set on Jeff's property. So here's a little clip uh, from that today. I'm watching Bobblehead Homestead live stream. Jeff just got his cabin delivered today, so pretty incredible. This has been, uh, a lot of people have been waiting for this for quite a long time. And there's Prepsteader Bob with Jeff. Let's see what they got to say. Well, welcome to Bobblehead Homestead, and thank you for doing all the work while I chat with my lovely viewers. Not a problem, that's what we're here for. Welcome to the Stuff for Light Roadshow. I'm wet all the way down to my socks. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> all right, so that was pretty cool. And if uh, I'll put a link in the description below. Go watch Jeff's uh, live stream of that cabin being put up there. He's a super guy uh, trying to set up his homestead and uh, just live a simple life with no drama. So congratulations, Jeff. Yesterday, I took down our big old hoop house tarp storage monstrosity down here. And man, what a difference. That thing took up that whole backyard. Now we can uh, get this cleaned up. We got a fire pit just around the corner and uh, you can sit there, look out at the river. Today, when I came down to let the chickens out, it just was so much nicer, so much more open and just beautiful to see that river there. I also took a little drone footage here today. Um, I'll show you that. And I did a little tree trimming. Unfortunately, uh, I did the tree trimming with the drone and uh, to my horror, the drone fell from the sky, smashed into the ground. And uh, I'm glad, happy to say that I was able to put it back together and it seems to work, but I will have to change the props. Um, the drone has a nice shade of green on the props now and on the top, so. Uh, it's beautiful. But anyway, here's some of that drone footage. So, just for a little sneak peek of the kitchen, what we're gonna do is we're gonna use this oak siding, like we're or oak pallets for siding, like we were talking about, but we're gonna paint it the same color as the cabin. And then we'll put the siding up to here, to there, and then this is gonna be screened in right here. We'll frame it in and put a screen in there. And then we're going to put shutters on there using all these old cedar boards that I have. And then I'll burn those shutters also. I just want to add that uh, the last video we asked for uh, your opinion on do you want to see the wood burnt, the siding, or do you want to see it uh, just oiled? We forgot option C, painted, so sorry about that. It kind of came up after I did the video and uh, it just would look nice if the cabin and the outdoor kitchen matched so that's what Jen and I came up with she did get some uh, old windows from her dad and we were going to use these in the outdoor kitchen these are from uh, Jen's grandfather's barn so uh, pretty cool but we're not going to use them on this project we decided 
screens going across here so when you're looking out this window you open the shutters and you got a nice view down there of the river so there's a little sneak peek of what we're doing with the outdoor kitchen and uh man i just want to say again congratulations to jeff at bobblehead homestead that was awesome thank you for putting that live stream on so we could watch that there were 1126 people watching that live stream at one point maybe more uh it was going up and down but there was a huge outpouring of support from people which was just awesome and uh I'll leave a link in the description below where you can see that live stream on Jeff's channel. And stay tuned to Jeff's, channels, uh, Jeff's channel because this weekend at Bobblehead Homestead, uh, there's a big work crew coming out there and Prepsteader Bob with the Self-Reliant Roadshow will be out there uh, for, I think, five days helping Jeff get that cabin ready to uh, be livable or at least get a lot of work done. So go over there, check it out. And thanks again for coming by the channel and we will see you next time.